and welcome back to Let's Play Resident Evil 2. It is I, Snare Player 921, and oh shit, it actually jumped. They see it's different already. This never happened to him before. Last time. From now on, everything changes. It won't be the same like you think it will be. It, it pretty much starts changing from here on out, which is good. Yeah, he just got implanted with an embryo. That's awesome. <laughs> so you've made it this far. Not bad, girl. I'm not letting anyone leave my town. Everyone's gonna die! Calm down, Chief. What happened? Shut up! You couldn't possibly understand what's happened. Those monsters from Umbrella have destroyed my beautiful town. How could they do that to me after everything I've done for them? So it's true. You have been working with Umbrella. Then you must know about the G-Virus. What is it? Tell me! If you must know, it's the agent that can turn humans into the ultimate bio-weapons. Superior to the T-Virus in every way. Dr. William Birkin is the genius behind the project. William Birkin? I'm sure you've already seen his little girl running around here somewhere. Sherry. In case you haven't already figured it out, the monster that's been tearing my prison apart is yet another product of the G-Virus. The ultimate bio -wing. Umbrella must be trying to cover its tracks. But if I have to go, I'm going to take you with me. Oh, I just... Are you okay, sir? Are you okay? Nope. <laughs> nope, he's not. He's dead. Chief Irons dies a very gruesome death. Which, I think the way he died last time was probably worse. I think he got both his legs chopped off by the... by William Bergen, but, you know. Okay. Now, we fight a boss. Yippee. The first boss in the game. Took long enough. Oh boy. Uh oh. Yep. Yeah. This is an easy fight, though. Just keep letting him have it. It's just that simple. I think I already got him. Or not. I thought I did. I was wrong. There we go. There we go. Get, get off me. Yeah. I could be wrong, because uh, that grenade launcher runs circles around Leon's shotgun any day, and that's basically what you have to use against him then, or the submachine gun, for that matter, which that's a good weapon to use too, even though it takes like the entire ammunition crate or ammunition thing or whatever of that submachine gun to even do that, to kill it. But, yeah. That only took three flame rounds and two or three acid rounds, that's... Yeah, three acid rounds. That's not bad at all. I'm still doing good. But that was all there was to that boss. Nothing special. Not at all. Gotta go pick up Sherry if you're wondering why I'm backtracking. 
Sherry being all annoying and shit, need me to hold her hand. Claire, you came back. I can't believe the man who developed the G virus is actually her father. Small world. What's wrong, Claire? It's nothing. But I think I found a way out of here. We should be able to find some place safe if we can just make it out of town. But... Don't worry, I'll protect you. I promise. But you have to make sure you don't leave my side. Leon, are you still there? We're leaving. Are you crazy? The streets are still crawling with zombies. It'll be alright, trust me. We found a way to the sewer. Follow us later. Is women never listen. Leon's like, hey, wait, I gotta say something. And she's just like, screw you, man. I'm talking to you. Why? I kind of forget there is still quite a good bit of game left. We are nowhere near done yet. <laughs> but that's okay. Oh, Sherry! And here comes the annoying part. If you run too fast, she will be left behind and just sit there and whine and complain. Oh, hi. Ada is a lot better. Ada will keep up with you when you're with Leon. I mean, Jesus. But Sherry just gets on my nerves. I never did know this, but y'all might know. But whatever happens to Sherry after this? Because after this, Sherry is non-existent. I figure she got foster parented or something. I, or maybe, uh, or it could be that, uh, she got taken by the government or something. I can't quite remember. But, I mean, if any of y'all know, say in the comments below what happened to Sherry after this game. Because I have no, I just can't remember or have no idea for that matter. Alright. Let's go, boys and girls. It wasn't Mr. X that time. It was the father. Shit's about to get real. Playing a Sherry again. This never happened in Claire Scenario B. It's all new. You see, there is a difference. Wait. I'd imagine there's a zombie somewhere. I'm just taking a wild guess. But yeah, you want to pick up anything you can find, too. yip a -doo! Good thing they only vomit on you. That's nothing. I'll take vomit any day. Hmm. This is where you're supposed to go. In the vent. Only she can fit in them. Woo! Oh, oh, not now. Not now! Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus! Well, that's annoying. That's what we need, is that. Uh-oh.
That's not creepy at all. What the father just did. <laughs> no, not that exactly, but might as well have been. I better grab at least one of those. Yeah, I'll take at least one. <laughs> you never know. A spider could just literally spit on me and make me poison and all bad things happen. Alright. Okay, for the next part of the game, well, actually, actually, let's go down here first and do this. This just basically leads to where Sherry was at, but I think there's some ammunition down here. That's what I wanted. Okay. I do believe there's some ammunition around here somewhere. Yep. It was worth it. Okay, for this part of the game, there is something you must not forget. I usually always forget this. I bet I'm not the only one that does this, but in here, in your chest, get the damn valve handle. If you don't get that, you're going to regret that later because it's a long-ass walk back to this chest to get it. Uh, well, I need anything else. Actually, yeah, let's do this real quick. Combine. I shouldn't need the acid rounds for a little bit at least, so I could put them in there. Um, I'll just put that in there because I don't believe I'll get hit by a spider, so I'm not too worried, but I'll keep it in there just so I have one. Uh, okay, we're good to go now. Let's see, is there anything in here? Oh, there's just an old locker, man. Oh, shit, hello. I could be wrong, it might be a bad idea just to even pick up a first aid spray, but too late now. But I think it's if you use one, it is a bad thing. And just for the hell of it, I better save. We just got past a boss fight and everything, so it's a good idea. Alright, put this back in here. Oh my god. Got plenty of ink ribbons. <clears throat> See, Leon ain't even there no more because if you played as Claire Scenario B, he would be sitting there. So, yeah, differences. Actually, let's go over here first. The spiders are way down the other way, so I ain't got to worry about them just yet. Something should be here. That works. I'll take that. Spiders. Yeah, that shit's what poisons you. Go oh, down. In an open space, these spiders are nothing. It's when they're in a tight space, like right there. But that's about the only spiders in the game that I'll see is Claire, I think, so not that bad. Uh-oh. Wandering around alone in the sewers. You have to help me find her. 
That's impossible. I told her to go to the police station. What's she doing here? William will be after her. William? That's right. The creature that's been causing all this destruction is none other than my own husband. Yay, cutscene time. Those rats were the carriers of the virus? As a result of his virus-induced transmutation, William should have lost any prior memories he had as a human by now. I tried to save him, but I'm afraid it's already too late. But... And that's not even the entire story. Every G-virus bioweapon, including William, has the ability to implant embryos into other life forms. That's why he's out. What are you trying to say? The bodies of individuals with non-related genetic coding are likely to reject the embryo. But since Sherry is his daughter, that possibility is non-existent. It's an inherent survival instinct. Ah! It's Sherry. You go that way. See, Annette actually locks her, so there you go. Well, I don't know if she really locks her or not, but she don't give me no problems, it's clear. And this is all I use the valve for, is just for these two spots. Yay. everybody. In the next episode, I shall continue with this. Later.